بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم we have two positive integers n and m we want to prove this result that if n to the power 1 over m that's the nth root of n if this is not an integer then it is an irrational number we want to show that if n is not a perfect nth power then it is not a rational number it must be irrational suppose that n to the power 1 over m is a rational number that is not an integer so it is not an integer but we will assume that this quantity is rational this quantity can be the square root of 2 it can be the cubic root of 29 and so on because n to the power 1 over m is a rational number that is not an integer then there exists a positive integer k such that n to the power 1 over m is living between k and k plus 1. let's define the set phi this is the set that contains the positive integers beta such that beta times n to the power v over m is a positive integer and what is v this statement here must be true for every v that is in the set from 1 all the way to m minus 1. set phi is the set of positive integers such that beta times n to the power 1 over m beta times n to the power 2 over m all the way to beta times n to the power m minus 1 over m all those must be positive integers this set here is non-empty because of our assumption that n to the power 1 over m is a rational number if n to the power 1 over m is a rational number then if we square it we get n to the power 2 over m squaring a rational number yields another rational number and so on if this is assumed to be rational then n to the power v over m is rational for every integer v those numbers here by our assumption are all rational numbers then a beta that satisfies this property that beta times this number and beta times this all the way to beta times n to the m minus 1 over m a beta that makes all those guys integers is the least common multiple of the denominators of those guys set phi is non-empty the lcm of the denominators or a multiple of the LCM will make those quantities in the set of positive integers. Let alpha be the minimum of set phi. This minimum exists by virtue of the well-ordering principle, which states that every non-empty subset of the positive integers has a least element. Consider alpha tilde. Alpha tilde is alpha, which is the minimum of the set phi times n to the power one over m minus k. Recall that we are assuming that n to the one over m is a rational number that is not an integer this rational number is between k and k plus one so we take n to the power one over m minus k which is strictly less than one we multiply by alpha that's alpha tilde alpha tilde is less than alpha because alpha tilde is alpha times a number less than one note that alpha tilde is an integer alpha tilde is equal to alpha times n to the power one over m minus alpha times k alpha is an element of set phi so alpha times n to the power 1 over m is an integer by how the set phi is defined. Alpha times k is another integer, and this difference is an integer. Alpha tilde is an integer that is strictly less than alpha. Let's examine alpha tilde times n to the power v over small m, where v, again, is 1 or 2 all the way to m minus 1. Alpha tilde is alpha, and then we have n to the power 1 over m minus k, and then we multiply by n to the power v over m. This is alpha times n to the power v plus 1 over m minus k alpha times n to the power v over m if v is between 1 all the way to m minus 2 then by the definition of set phi and by the fact that alpha is in the set phi it is the minimum of the set then this is an integer and this is an integer k is an integer so this is an integer what if v is equal to m minus 1 in this case alpha tilde times n to the power m minus 1 over m is equal to alpha n minus k alpha n to the power m minus 1 over m this is an integer times an integer these two guys are integers and this is an integer what we have is alpha tilde is a positive integer alpha tilde belongs to the set phi why is this because if we take alpha tilde times n to the power v over m this is an integer for every v that is in the set from 1 to m minus 1 so far so good but here is the contradiction. Alpha tilde is strictly less than alpha. But alpha is the minimum of this set. This is a contradiction. And because of this contradiction, our assumption is false. n to the power 1 over m, if it's not an integer, it's not a rational number. n to the power 1 over m must be 
y resuelve.